Okay, welcome back, guys. It's Landis. First off, I want to mention that um, because I'm including the audio and cutscenes from this game, there might be. I know one for sure has been uh, hit with a copyright or recognizes third party content. Uh, I highly recommend that you use Adblock or something else just in case people start throwing ads on these videos. They're never intended to have ads, so if they do, uh, I want you guys to be able to watch this without having to deal with that crap because it's dumb. So if you're not using it, use Adblock. That said, let us get into it. Uh, mission start. Here we go. You know what? I should probably... You know what? Hold on a second. Quit. Mission. Yes. Hold on a second. I'm gonna, I, this is killing me. There we go. <clears throat> Okay. Now Trish should look like Trish whenever cutscenes show up. Don't ask me why I care, but I do. Okay. Also, um, I'm never going to take half an hour to finish a single mission in the game. And so I'm probably just going to do two missions every video regardless of how long it takes. It should never go over 45, unless you're looking at this video right now and it's over 45. Either way, I'm just gonna try to get through this as soon as I can. Uh, this is a maze. Uh, what's her face? I set up these warping portals all over the place, but I think I know the shortest way through this stuff. <laughs> Stinger is really, really good in this game. Like, too good. Whoops. Okay. And from here, I think we can try... Oh, we're going to actually have to fight here. We're going to try to head to the kind of mausoleum area. Oh man, I'm gonna get all you guys. Just go ahead and bunch up like that, I don't care. Okay. Now that's gonna warp us out. Okay, into here, which is fine. I think what I'm trying to do is get to that bridge area. Ah, <laughs> uh, Swordmaster level 3. I never got to show you that stuff in DMC3. It's not much different, though. Like, it's pretty similar to how it was in DMC3. There's, you know, the slight differences in mood and whatnot, but essentially, it, the, the last ability, like, all this I'm doing right here, all the same combo. It's all the same thing. Oh. That's not me manually putting in something. All the way up to the baseball swing. This should take me to the bridge, right? Okay, yeah. So, you'll actually get lost in here a lot for a long time if you just keep running around. The exit is actually right underneath the bridge. That's like the the, the big thing. 
that gets you inside the, the mausoleum area. Oh, actually, oh, ruined church. My bad. And it's so here's this puzzle again. It is unchanged. Like legitimately, it's the exact same thing. No, I'm just gonna double trigger through this. I don't hate the blades on these guys. And Dante's DT isn't knocked back by that stuff, so. Okay, so. Yeah. Oh, ta. Okay, back the way I came, and then to the right. To the right again. We should just be about out of here. Yeah. Hey, I think we did it. Now we get to fight this chick again. Yeah, there's air hike, shooting star, okay. If you know, I don't know if you've noticed yet, but Dante's actually used, the sword he's using is Rebellion. It's the same sword that he used in Devil May Cry 3 because he gave the Sparta sword to uh, Trish in Devil May Cry 1. So he went back to using Rebellion. Who the hell are you? <laughs> Glad I got your attention. I was beginning to feel a little ignored. You may jest, but the kindest fate I offer is to unify and spend eternity with a child of mine! Master. Oh yeah, buddy. You're getting it. Oh gosh, I didn't shouldn't have done that. See, now I don't have a uh, Nero to grab this chick and do extra damage. So now it's just a regular. Whoop! Oh gosh, that goes all the way down. That gum. So it's just a regular stun. Ah, oh, it's. Switch the trickster and try to get out of there, but it did not happen. Oh gosh, trickster! I needed to get out of there. Golly, reaching for trickster on on the fly like that is not always the best. Oh, dude, I think you just killed yourself. Nope, survive. Oops, I was in Swordmaster, the gummit. Yeah, 
You're done. You're so done. You're so done. Hmm. Dante, don't even play. I think that looks suits you better. Gilgamesh, guys. I absolutely love it. Garugamesh. Freaking rules of nature, man. Now, I can't purchase the abilities from Gilgamesh, but now I can freely change between the two. Let's see what Swordmaster gets us. So, of course we have our basic combos, right? This is basic the basic melee combo that you get in all times, but just like all the other times, you can charge them up for extra damage. So all hits get charged. All right, so uh, my moves are such, okay, until I buy new ones. In uh, Swordmaster, I get uh, a little AoE punch. And of course, oh, that's good. That's actually uh, me holding this and then tapping circle again. Do I get anything on back? Oh yeah, I remember that. Oh boy. That's like classic Shoryuken. Like if you can get that to land. Hmm. All right. Uh, let's go ahead and get everything we can out of Garugamesh. Come on, give me power up, skill up, swords, Garuga Mesh. Ah, oh, freaking kick 13. Love it. And flush. Oh, that's just. Jumps now do damage. That's always good. Well, I mean, honestly, no, it's not good. It's just. It looks neat. So basically, we're backtracking the game uh, from Nero all the way back. The unfortunate thing is, and this is like probably my biggest complaint about Devil May Cry 4, you hardly have any missions with Dante. You get this play as Dante in mission 12, and like mission 18, you start playing as Nero again. So you get so few missions with Dante, when this is like one of the best iterations of the character. Oh, yeah, there's a killer. Can I charge it? No, I can't. What I want is to get that back, back B ability off, but I don't know if I can do it here. Oh gosh, kick 13 is so good! Alright, let's wait for the next head to pop up. You get taken to a room where you have to fight. Okay, here we go. Ugh! Ugh! Sure you can! <coughs> I'll throw it back on Trickster for a bit.
Oh, never mind. Gunslinger it is. And we got handguns. Alright, where are you? Come on, come on, come on, come on. Nope, gotta go. Yeah, I still get hit 13, even gunslinger. I missed. Nope, oh, this is gonna be bad. Haha, <laughs> yeah, I was hoping that would be enough to kill him. Alright, here we go. Come on, take it, take it, take it, take it, take it, take it, take the cloak, take the cloak, take the cloak! Ah! sloppy work anyways. Get out of the wall, dude! Really? I'm gonna kill him before I take his cloak. That was almost bad. I probably need to say tricks. Wow. I'm gonna keep on tricks for a bit just to make sure I have the mobility in case uh, I end up. Oh gosh, that! That is exactly why. I was trying to trace stay trickster. Oh. You suck. Dante is a flexible dude. Do I have to do this entire fight over again? Yes, I do. See? Come on, now. I thought I was going to get caught in that. That Helmbreaker put me right back on it. Yeah, we're going to stay trickster for the time being. Oh! Oh, boy. Yeah. 
What kind of bugs me is that there's never going to be a, a real Devil May Cry 5. Uh, I was actually talking to the guys in the mag about DMC earlier, and I have come to the decision that Devil May Cry 2 does have, uh, like, does continue. Uh, the story does continue. And um, it does in uh, Shin Megami Tensei uh, Nocturne. If you uh, have not played it, it is an RPG where, uh, oh wow, I killed that thing, cool. It's an RPG where Dante is a playable character, and it's him basically fighting Satan. You can, basically the final boss of the game could be Satan, which is pretty much what Dante was implying at the end of DMC 2. So, I am going to believe that the DMC, like, oop! The DMC universe actually ends in SMT Nocturne. And this game takes place before DMC 2. Like, right before, actually. Like, he just kind of hanging back before he gets the call. But hey, guess what? We're out of here. I actually don't remember how far into... Oh yeah, now I remember. You actually have to spend some time back in that castle a good bit. But we get a new gun for doing it. Which is cool. Hmm. Now I have a dilemma. Uh, I believe that was our second mission. But we have not hit the half hour mark. But you know what? I don't think I care. Um, I'll go ahead and kill it here. And we'll catch it back up. And make some more progress. So, um, until next time guys. Take it easy.